Welcome back to 40 TV. I'm your host, 40. Today I'm going to show you how to upgrade the memory in your Mac Pro. I've got a 2009 model here that comes standard with 8GB. I purchased the 16GB kit on Amazon.com. I've opened the, the uh, side compartment of my Mac Pro and then located the two tabs, the memory and CPU tray on the bottom. Push them down and then pull them out like so. That unlocks the tray and allows you to gently slide it out. Upon sliding it out, I saw I had tons of dust. So I blew some of the dust off. Alternatively, you could use an air duster here that has compressed air. The first thing I did was loosen all the memory slots because I was going to move the 2 gigabyte RAM chips into the back slots so it addresses the 16 gigs before it hits these 8 gigs. The 16 gigabyte upgrade kit is a set of four 4 gigabyte chips. My Mac Pro came with four 2 gigabyte chips. Once this install is complete, I should have 24 gigabytes of RAM. Here you can see I'm doing the same thing taking the two gigabyte chips out from the first slots and moving them into the back ones. I believe that having more memory to be addressed first will speed up most applications, as most applications are not going to utilize the full 24 gigs of memory that I'm going to have in my computer. Be careful when upgrading memory in your computer not to be electrostatically charged. I have my shoes off here and made sure that I touched metal to ground myself before doing this install. Also make sure to align the memory in the memory slots. There's a small little uh, space inside of the memory that aligns with a little uh, separator inside of the slot. Make sure to press down firmly to click these into place. When done correctly, the side tabs will click into the sides of the memory. Be careful not to run your finger along the <laughs> memory as I did right here in the video. This can actually cut your finger because these PCB boards are actually pretty sharp. When putting back your CPU slash memory tray, be careful to slide it into place. As you push down, then push in the clips. Make sure it's firmly seated inside the tray. I give one final blow to remove any excess dust. If I had any compressed air, I would have used compressed air here. Now, put your cover back onto the computer and lock it back in place with the latch on the back of your Mac Pro. And there you have it, completed. Okay, now that the computer's booted up, let's verify that OS X recognizes the memory we installed. Remember, this computer had 8 gigabytes before we started this install. Go up to the Apple menu on the top left of your OS and select About This Mac. You'll see right here under Memory, it shows 24 gigabytes. 8 plus 16 is 24, so it looks like we're good to go. Guys, I hope you liked the tutorial. If you have questions about the memory I bought, the optional equipment such as the dust off compressed air or the anti-static wristband, I'll leave that information in the header of the video. Again, thanks for watching guys. If you like the content, please like and subscribe. Until next time, I'm out.